Okay. Okay. So, Ratu, I did send you quite a few thangs on Instagram. Do your thang. Hang Were you on. able to look at any of them? I have. Okay, cool. So we'll just start from the first one. I'll put it up on screen for everybody. You must delete three of these from ever existing, and the rest you get to keep. Okay. Three of them delete, the rest you keep. I already got my three. I already got my three, too. <laughs> Actually, hold on, wait a minute. So on the list, we have TikTok, Spotify, Xbox, PlayStation, X, formerly known as Twitter, uh, Snapchat. <laughs> <laughs> I sent this man a Twitter feed on. <laughs> I, I, I sent him a Twitter post through messages. <laughs> through a text message. You sent me the URL. The URL. No one ever does anymore. <laughs> And it just showed X.com. And he freaked out. Like, did you just send me? I said, what the hell did you? <laughs> and he goes, oh, Twitter. <laughs> it, caught, it caught me through a loop. I said, X.com. I said, what the hell did you send me? <laughs> oh, never mind. It's Twitter. <laughs> hey, you didn't you try this? <laughs> uh, leading on Snapchat, YouTube, uh, Nintendo Switch, and Instagram. Now, okay. there are two of these right off the bat. I can live without. Okay. That's going to be Snapchat and Twitter. Okay. Snapchat and Twitter, I don't, I, I'm, I was on Snapchat for like three months mm -hmm. and it got old for me, especially because, um, you know, Instagram likes to steal everything. Yeah. So Instagram, for those of you guys that don't know, used to just be pictures. And then when Vine was popping off, they integrated videos. Freaking Vine. Mm-hmm. Vine was. Shout out to Vine. Yeah. Top tier. But created my well created the the stem the stem of uh, ADHD <laughs> and shorter attention attention spans. Jesus. Mm hmm. Facts. I don't even know the last time I went on Snap. I really, really don't. When when was it popping off? Like two thousand sixteen, maybe two thousand seventeen. Yeah, that sounds about right. Right. I was on. I I caught on like maybe twenty eighteen. Uh huh. I, I want to say like between like around this time of the year uh, between uh, spring and summer, and it just it wasn't appealing to me. It just you. wasn't. You know what's funny it was a lot. Yeah, twenty sixteen sounds about right because that's when I I would come over a lot, and a lot of my memories were on Snapchat. Come over like here. I come I over. Didn't, I didn't. I didn't move in until twenty eighteen. What did I have in... Oh, okay, 2016, I have a lot of memories. Okay. Yeah, 2018. Yeah, 2018, 2019, I remember I was coming here a lot. Yeah. And we would just make, like, just random videos. I do remember that. It was hilarious. Okay, so what would but your yeah. third be? Um, so, yeah, Snapchat, don't need Twitter or X. I remember Twitter used to be it. It used to be the one. But it has grown into... Twitter X has evolved into just a a cesspool of just random majority toxic stuff. And I'm I'm okay with not having that in my life. But for number three, that's rough. Number three, Xbox, Spotify, TikTok, uh, PlayStation, YouTube, Nintendo Switch, and Instagram. I need Spotify. I need my music. You gotta have your music. Gotta have the music. YouTube, my main source of entertainment. Gotta keep YouTube. Wouldn't have, wouldn't be able to post this podcast without it. Yeah, wouldn't be able to post a podcast without it. Um, Instagram, I still enjoy. Yeah, there's a lot of toxic things in there as well, but there is, for at least in my feed, a, still a lot of creative content up. Yeah, TikTok. I feel the same way about Instagram. <coughs> if I were to choose between the two, I'd probably pick Instagram. But realistically, I'm probably on TikTok more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is strange to say. So that comes down to PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, and Xbox. Now, I don't have an Xbox One or One X. But I have an Xbox 360. I have a PlayStation 4. And I have a Nintendo Switch. Which I haven't touched my Nintendo Switch 
for years until until like Soulja Boy's <laughs> until this past Friday. Past Friday. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. I didn't even know you had a Nintendo Switch until you said <laughs> I had one. I was like, really? <laughs> Two. <laughs> Where is that mother? <laughs> yeah. And then, like, when she started cleaning everything up, I was like, "Oh, yeah, it's it's <laughs> hidden in the console." Like, that's a fairly equipped, yeah, 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 yeah. entertainment. Funny enough, is like I think I remember I saw a couple switches, uh, switch games laying around, and I was just like, "I wonder if this is yours or Selena's." Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, I just don't know. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably have to leave Xbox in the dust. Another one boss the dust. You know, it's just <laughs> like when I got my 360. I got my 360 late, like 2012. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that's just like that's an automatic reaction now. When you're like a timeline, you just gotta just say, "Damn!" <laughs> but I haven't kicked, I haven't turned that thing on since I want to say 2017. Mm. Yeah, it hasn't been on for a hot minute. But when I was, when I when I did have it, I brought that mother everywhere. I like that thing stayed in the original. I got it used. Yep. I'm not fronting. I got it used. It stayed in the original. Uh, Game stock, uh, Game Stop, cardboard box mm-hmm. with the two controllers and whatever and whatever uh, uh, games that I had, which I only had a handful. It was it was normally like Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm, and that was probably like the only game that I brought. Oh, and Halo, I think. But yeah, uh, since I mean, Halo was the only thing that that drove me toward the Xbox. Pretty much every other game that I like was on PlayStation or on PC. Specifically, Kingdom Hearts was PlayStation. So, I mean, yeah, I'd probably have to leave Xbox in the dust. Another one buys the dust. Yeah. What about you, bro? What would um, what would be the three that you do have? My three, to be honest, and it's just the three that I just don't ever use. Snapchat. It was I used it a lot between that time, mm-hmm. and then it died down. I think after. Maybe 2018, 2019, I used it a couple times, but that was it. Like, Probably you know. when uh, Instagram started introducing stories also. Touche. That, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, because you're on Instagram, you're already getting yeah. the stuff, plus the stories are there. It's like, screw it. Yeah. Yeah, now Snapchat is just just a lot of, you just use it for ho. I don't personally <laughs> use it. <laughs> but I know. I know a lot of people that were using it just for their ho shiz. You know, like they were just, <laughs> But I know the filters on Snapchat is was was pretty pristine. Like it was pretty up there. Like the the granny filter. There was a there was a oh the gender the gender switch. Yeah, the gender switch was wild. When I saw myself and I looked just like my mom, I deleted my Snapchat. I I wasn't even instantly. I wasn't even. I remember someone showed it to me, and I go, "Nope, delete that." What's crazy is like I didn't even look like my mom. I just look like uh um, gotta look at yours again. The I matchmaker from, from Mulan. <laughs> Fa Mulan. Fa Mulan. <laughs> Pour the tea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Snap, yeah, Snapchat, I, I could live without. You okay. Know. Uh second for me would be TikTok because I don't I don't have a TikTok. I thought that was going to be a first, honestly. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I did, but I just wanted to speak my truth on Snapchat. You so, know. Shout out to I, I want to address this, actually. How come you don't have TikTok? It was another thing. When TikTok started becoming popular, I think it was, uh, when was it? Like, 2021? Like, ended, like mid-2021? Like, during COVID? No, TikTok, TikTok was already popping, I think, 2019. No, TikTok became really popping 2019, 2018, when Vine shut down completely. Okay, okay. But, like, I think when I remember it being was, like, I think end of, I, I think for me, it was, like, around end of 2021. I think okay. I just remember it being around more, like, the people around yeah. me. Like, oh, TikTok. Oh, yeah, people to... blew up on yeah, TikTok yeah. during the pandemic, for sure. I just, I think it was just, uh, like, like you know, in, like me, is like, I have an addictive personality. Like, Instagram already eats up most of my time, which I went on that hiatus because... He sure did. It just, it just, I just couldn't do it anymore, and I just don't need something else just eating up my time. Like Instagram enough is already just so draining for me. I don't need TikTok. Well, I don't mind watching TikToks if people send it to me. But you I, don't want to be on. And shout out to TikTok thing. for being able to be watchable. It's not like oh, you know, in order to watch this, you got to download the app. At least I could watch no, yeah, one yeah. video if someone ten, uh, sends it to me via text. Yep. At least TikTok will allow me to watch it. So shout out to TikTok, but I just can't have another thing on my phone. I get it. Just eating up my time. 
I get it. And I one hundred percent get because, it. Because you know, and if it because TikTok, at least a good ninety percent of TikTok videos make its way to either YouTube or Instagram. Yeah, that's you true. You know what I mean? So like I was just like, it's gonna make its way down to Instagram eventually. But props to TikTok for, you know, just doing what it's doing. But I personally I could I could delete that. Yeah. And third is Xbox because PS4 game, PS5. Sorry, oh, PlayStation PS4. game. Regardless, you've been on PlayStation Five for a minute. <laughs> PS4 was my first PlayStation I ever owned. Was it really? Yeah. Oh shoot. Yeah. I would always be at like people's houses. They'd have like their PlayStation. Like when I was a kid, PlayStation Two yep. would be around for the longest, and PlayStation right. Three. You know, like. And I remember I played a couple of Xbox games, but I think it's just because I played more PlayStation growing up. I just liked it more. I get you. You know, and that. yeah, so Xbox deuces. All right, hey, valid deuces. That's fair. That's fair. All right. Plus, I would never play with my ex's box. You know what I'm saying? Because no, just my <laughs> ex's box is crazy. <laughs> my ex's box is wild. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that's my my top three. For me, I know what you get from uh, in regards of like Twitter. Because, yeah, I think Vine, towards the end of Vine, it was like that a lot. Like, just nothing but ads, yeah. like negative things. For me, I could, I, there's a feature on, on X or slash Twitter, like, where you can just watch your timeline of only the people that you follow. Yeah. But there's always also a timeline where it's a general. Um, like, recommended for you. Yeah, pretty much. And that right there is wild. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, it's. It get me in trouble a couple times in, in no. public places. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I was going to say. Because I work in marketing, it's very funny to see how my recommended, my For You page yeah. it is. Because, like, half of it is stuff that I'm actually interested in. The other half is random stuff that's, like, something trending, something yeah. viral, something mm-hmm. like that. And it's, like, not even in my, like, general interests. Like, I could just, I could be watching, like, oh, a fail video. Oh, a uh, cover video. Oh. Uh, makeup tutorial. What the hell is that? Or next one. Yeah. Oh, it's uh, a transition video, like with music of some random thing. And I'm just like, wow, this is strange. And yep. it's hilarious because I've capitalized on some of those like trending videos before. There you go. It's like, would you would you rather have a night with us five or PlayStation five? I I think you said that to the. Uh, I forget, I think you, I don't know. Someone sent it. I think oh, Crystal sent it to this group chat. I'll send a show to you later, but yeah, it, it's like shit like that. It's be on like random Twitter. stuff. Yeah. And like I use that to capitalize for marketing. Yeah. Like it's, it's trending, especially if you have seen recently, it's, it's the, the fail videos. Some of the, some of these, the, I think the first, the first like ever video done was like, uh, like a car dealership, like ad. It was so funny. It was like this, this dude, like on a skateboard or something. He falls, eats shit, <laughs> and then oh, it, it transitions it, it transitions to the, to the guy like, "Hey, come get your new car." And man, like, those right there top, is top tier. tier. Whoever the marketing guy is, there they need a raise. They need their there's own a, office. There's a lot of them, and I'm just like, they are good for you, clever, good for you. Yeah, absolutely. There's some that's very outlandish, and they still stick to the script. And I'm just like, solid, props solid to you. ten out of ten. Props would, to you. I would definitely recommend that. Hilarious. But all right. On to the next one. So I sent brought to another thing. And said this is the only verses that matters honestly. Is this your booty pick? Oh sorry. Oh you know. <laughs> uh it's Cartoon Network versus Nickelodeon. This is tough, bro. This is a really tough one. Cause okay, so I'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave the picture on screen for a minute. Because there are some bangers on this. On this little uh, banger, picture. I hardly know her, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have sexual relations with that woman. <laughs> <laughs> but um, on the Nickelodeon side, uh, right off the top, we have Fairly Odd Parents. We have Angry Beavers. I'm I'm only gonna call out the ones that that I like. Invaders. Oh, okay, okay. That's Invader you. Zim. Okay, okay. Jimmy Neutron, Rugrats, uh, SpongeBob, Avatar. That's that's what... Avatar: The Last Airbender is the is the biggest one for me. Uh, Danny Phantom. Danny Phantom. Shout out to Danny Phantom. Shout out to Danny Phantom. Uh, did you know the rapper of Danny Phantom, the the theme song mm-hmm. is DJ D-Rex? 
Is it really? Is it, it is. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I found that out. Like, was, was Nick Cannon still working at Nickelodeon with Danny? I think so, right? I think Nick Cannon was. Yeah, I think so. Uh, I think he was still a part of it, at least. Um, yeah, that's hilarious. That's wild, right? Random, random fun fact. But then you go over to the Nickelode or the uh, Cartoon Network side. First Man, of all, I want to go off the bottom. You, you okay? You lead. You lead. Uh, Cartoon kids Network next side. door. Mm. K and D. K, K, kids next. Kids next door. It's how most. It's how most people our age learned about bras. <laughs> Battle ready armor. Battle ready. I forgot armor. who someone brought that up just recently. I forgot where I was, but yeah, Battle ready armor literally just came up in a conversation. Um. <laughs> Uh, Johnny Bravo. Johnny, the the Bravo. first the first manho. <laughs> the first the first the OG cartoon manho. Okay, there's Deuce Bigelow. There's like quite a few like, but cartoon wise was hilarious. Mm-hmm. This guy was a player. Okay, oh, yeah. Samurai Jack. Samurai Jack. That's how I knew it was gonna be late. Man, I forget <laughs> the voice actor's name. Uh, it's like, is it Lamar or something? He voiced a lot. He voiced a lot of characters. Black dude. I I forget your name. I'm sorry. I'll put it on the screen. Flowers to you, bro. He has one hell of a IMDb really like repertoire. He's good. Oh, okay, hold on. We got time. Let me look at this. Yeah, Let yeah, me yeah. look at this mug. Yeah. Okay. You can go ahead and finish up the the list while I look okay, up. Yeah, yeah, while you, I look up Samurai Jack. You look it up. Okay. Next up, we have Teen Titans. Woo! The original animated Woo! Teen Titans. What what a goat! What absolute slept on, not even well ne, by na, now standards. Ste- yeah, 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 by yeah. now standards because there's a lot. Honestly, Young Justice, Young Justice, I think took the mantle. Young Justice was yeah up there, it's but, good, but it's good. It's but Teen too. Titans crawled, so oh no, yeah, yeah, so, no, so Teen Young Titans Justice, crawled yeah, so yeah, they yeah. could walk, yeah, yeah, so yeah. they could be running, bro, absolutely. But Phil Lamar, Sorry, Phil Lamar, I'm gonna cut him off, but Phil Lamar, yep. Um, go ahead, go let's, ahead. Let's, Give him his flowers. Kung Fu Panda for mm-hmm. this. I'm going based off recent. Okay, yep. uh, second best hospital now. Loud House. I don't know Loud House, but Masters of the Universe. I know that Invincible, Bob's yep. Burgers for the people that do like yeah, Star Trek, American Dad, Futurama. Oh damn, he did a lot in Futurama. He did 129 episodes. Yeah, Mortal Kombat, the game Har- Harley Quinn. Harley Quinn's a great show, by the way. Uh, is it really the animated one? Yeah, I heard it was really good. Really good, but he's yeah, he he's has a both... repertoire. He has oh, a, Family Guy. He has a catalog. He has a he has a catalog. <laughs> he has a lot. Dang, yeah, he does. It's I, yep. I'm sorry, I'm not doing a good job, but overall, if you guys look up his IMDb, Phil Lamar, Phil Lamar, go. He's solid. Solid. He's young. Solid. He was on Young Justice too. Oh yeah, I bet. He, he did King Oren. Okay, Aquaman. Oh, Green Beetle. Okay. Wow. Did Flash, Green Lantern, and then one of the Teen Titan goes. Mm-hmm. Wow. Okay, sorry. Continue. No, yet. Yeah. Pete the Cat. Right. He did Pete the Cat. Yo. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> it's a former parent. <laughs> Pete the Cat is fire, dog. <laughs> <Yeah>. Sorry. Continue. Lamar. <laughs> Flowers, bro. Flowers, dog. Absolutely. But we have Ed, Ed, and Man, Ed, Ed, and was trying to teach you how to hustle at a young age. Get but your what bread that up. mouth do, though? Get that bread up. <laughs> I know. That jawbreaker, though. We were talking about it. We were talking about it on Soulja Boy. Soulja Boy, Soulja Night. Man, when they be putting those jawbreakers in, they... <laughs> that, that is a basketball. <laughs> that might be crazy. Okay, who else? What are you looking at? Dexter's Lab. Diddy! <laughs> Diddy! Why are you in my laboratory? <laughs> or I don't know how he yeah. did it, but man! Go. Uh, Cow Chick was alright. Okay. Um, Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends, I think it slept on. Bro. Slept on. Bro. Man, one, the, one of the most like punny episodes was when they introduced Cheese. Oh, we have to watch that one again. Because it was. Cheese was supposedly Mac's other imaginary friend that he came up with, like, I think when he was sleeping or something. Oh, I think I remember that one. Okay, okay, So then they did Mac and Cheese. They did Blue Cheese. (laughs) (laughs) One one point that I'll never forget. It's hot in Topeka. 
Mecca. <laughs> it's just so random. I watched um, Imaginary Friends with Ryan Reynolds, John Krasinski, and it gives very Fosters vibes. Like, vibes. But if they made a live action Fosters, like, like based off of that, that would have been solid. Yo, okay. Yeah. But Fair. Fosters, yes, top tier, man. I remember the website. Oh, I believe Phil, Phil Lamar was um was Wilt, basketball boy. I believe so. I you know I wouldn't even put it past it. Yeah, I believe that is Phil could have voiced God, and I'd be like, yep, I believe it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Powerpuff Girls, Power, man, can't can't deny sugar, spice, and everything nice, and everything nice. <laughs> Mojo uh, Jojo, Mojo Jojo. Actually, shout out to my boy, uh, Irving. Shout out to my boy. He he uh he did a uh like a live action one on YouTube. Mm. Man, man, man's actually doing work. He oh, nice. he actually recently uh, uh him King Vader all all of them they did um like a, a commercial for uh, Bad Boys Four with uh, Will Smith. And Martin Lawrence. I just saw that one with King Vader when yeah. uh when there was like, have you seen these gentlemen? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was yeah. looking at I was just because I remember it popped up my timeline without even looking at whose profile it was. Yeah, I was like, why does he look familiar? I didn't realize how tall King Vader was. <laughs> oh, boy is tall. Boy is tall. He is tall. <laughs> tall as a lightsaber. Yeah, yeah man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he's also do. Uh, I don't know if they're actually doing like a full project on it, but they did like this, like action, like trailer, like a movie style trailer, mm -hmm. uh, with Kel Mitchell. Oh, okay. Called uh, I think it's called Invisible Man. Uh, it's actually pretty. I'll show it to you after. It's pretty. Okay. Pretty solid. Okay. Okay. But um, who we got next? Yeah. Uh, oh, ben Ten. Ben Ten. Boy. Ben. Boy. Ten. There's an argument. There's an argument going Excuse around. Excuse me. And actually, uh, the boys, King Vader, and everybody were popping off on on this uh, topic. Also, Ben Ten beats Goku. I know that sounds crazy, but hear me out. What is Goku? A Saiyan mm -hmm. from another planet, a.k.a. an, an alien. alien. Okay. The Omnitrix gives you the best form of any alien species. The best form. Of any alien species, I don't know all of them. There's a whole, there's a whole, there's a whole thread online about it. I'm just saying that might be a valid statement. I'd be damned if Ultra Instinct Goku gets beat by a dude with a watch. <laughs> dude, <laughs> by, by a boy with a watch. You know what time it is? <laughs> <laughs> turns right into Goku. No, it turns into into Ultra Instinct Vegito. Ma Ooh. Dunzo. Dunzo, bro. Wow. Turns into Ultra, Ultra Instinct Broily? Oh, Broily. <laughs> is it Broily? Broily, bro. bro, broly, bro. The way you mentioned, the way you said it sounded like a freaking uh, spaghetti dish. You said Broily? Like, what? what? <laughs> <laughs> um, but. I, you know, that, that's, a, that's a whole other debate. We'll, we'll set that aside for now. Me and Rathu will do some research on that. Going back to this list. One of my favorites put fear into, into the heart of every child of the 90s. Courage the Cowardly when Dog. When Courage the Cowardly Dog came on at night, that, that, that means time to go to sleep. It's time to go <laughs> to sleep. Or I go to Nickelodeon. No, but let, <laughs> let me tell you something. I watched the episode <clears throat> of, of Return the Slab or Suffer Mike. I watched that. One in the afternoon, well lit room, and was still petrified. I was still scared. I don't remember ever finishing an episode of Courage the Cowardly Dog. Really? I don't think I. I think I because Courage would come out like in two episodes, right? Like one. Yeah. Like kind of like SpongeBob. Kind of, yeah, or like Rugrats format. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Be, uh, It'd be stacked. Stories. Yeah, I. I don't think I ever finished like one whole thirty minute. I would always like, you know, on the watch one on the oh, controller. Yeah. You do like the the channel back or the the previous the channel, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Disney something, you know, something rotate. like <laughs> rotate. If something boop. got too scary, boop, real quick. Boop. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I ever finished. Um... That unlocked the memory, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> 
I was oh thinking about that right God. now because I remember I would usually use that channel for something inappropriate. For <laughs> if I knew like a sex scene was coming, like, and I knew I was hoping to change, but mostly when it would be like <laughs> cur- like anything scary, like I would be I'd be hooked. But if something I knew something was gonna pop off, dude, change, change it real I'm quick, immediate. But mm-hmm. shout out to Courage and Cowardly Dog because. That boy had no business being in the situations that he's been. <laughs> so you know it, the the final episode of Courtesy Cowardly Dog, I believe, was a crossover movie with uh, Scooby Doo. Really? With, with what's new Scooby Doo? What's new Scooby Doo? So do you know you. the reason why? Sorry, go ahead. The reason why so much happened, like on their farm, because apparently they were on top of the gates of hell. Yeah, and that's canon. That's like legit. Crazy, right? It's crazy. <laughs> that's why I never watched it. I I was a nice little church boy <laughs> watching this and I was like, I don't like this at all. I feel uncomfortable. That, that that's a whole other story as well. Wow. Yeah, crazy, right? Absolutely insane. What's but um, Actually that's disrespectful. They didn't even put um Scooby Doo on this. Actually you're right. You're right. That's facts. Because Scooby Doo was a one of the big reasons why I would be watching it. Yeah, but I, did it play on both platforms? I think it was. It pl- no, it played Car- on Cartoon Network, mostly. Cartoon Network, and uh, Kids WB because it was oh, okay. Warner Brothers. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah. So, damn, that's actually crazy. And then the the other ones. Um, Adventure Time. Uh, Adventure Time. Oh, sorry. I really like before we go to the newer ones, you you can't skip. Uh, Adventures of Billion Man. The Grim yeah. Adventures of Billion Man. Yeah, honestly, was I wasn't that into it, but there were a lot of things very entertaining. Yes. Hi, you killed my yogurt. Oh my god! My name is Fred Fred Burger, and I spell my name real good. I think you. I think you did this in a video once, me and you. We did. It was. You want to know where I did this on video? It was me, you, uh, Ryan Ginto. And Donatus. And Donatus. <laughs> right after we saw, right after we saw Despicable in me. theaters, Despicable Me. <laughs> Went to the Apple store. You know, when, when uh, back in our, in our, like, in us, it, Victoria Gardens would be the hangout spot. Victoria Gardens are Ontario Mills. Yep. But most of the time, Victoria Gardens, because it was just more of the newer thing at that time, compared to Ontario Mills, where yep. we felt like it was run down. Mm-hmm. It would be, it'd be Victoria Gardens. Watch a movie. Mm-hmm. Freaking go to the Apple Store. Take them. Take them. The pictures on that webcam. Mm-hmm. <laughs> off of the off. Of, it wasn't even a, like a laptop. It was an iMac. It was an actual iMac. It was an actual iMac. Yep. I, re- I remember that. Oh my god. That <laughs> when so when did this pickle me come out? Like two thousand eight? No, 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 no. Two thousand nine. I think I was. Both me and Denise were definitely graduated then. I want to say like late two thousand nine or early two thousand ten. If I can't, when that came I can't out. spell. Hilarious. That's... I don't want to watch Despicable Me 4. I mean, I do want to watch Despicable Me 4. But F-R-E-D. I just... <laughs> F-R-E-D. F-R-E-D. Okay, 2010. B-U-R-G. Damn, I was in high school still? God damn. B-R. Fred Redberger, yeah. <laughs> 2010? 2010, bro. Crazy, right? 14 years ago. Don't say it like that. Oh, my God. I... This movie is a whole teenager. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. This thing, this... This movie hit puberty already. <laughs> Man. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 14 wow. years ago? Wow. Wow, that's crazy. And they're working on Despicable Me, Despicable Me 4. 4? hmm I believe it. I mean, didn't Minions have its own whole side movie, too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still all good. I think they Crazy. kept up pretty well on, on all movie franchises for uh, Despicable. Fair. Okay, where were we at before I get too distracted? Okay. Um, then there's a regular show, Steven Universe, which I did hear Steven Universe was pretty good, actually. Okay. Um, and then that's all they showed in that picture. All right. But I think between the two, Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon, now, if we want to expand a little bit further, even outside of, of cartoons, because if we're counting cartoons, I would say, I would say Cartoon Network takes it down. 
I would, yeah, Cartoon Network for sure. If we were to throw in regular shows, like the sitcom shows, mm. uh, we're yeah. talking Nickelodeon Drake and Josh, t- yeah. iCarly, The Victorious, all that, The Amanda Show. Granted, all those shows, I know they are under uh, heat right now because of what happened in the background. Oh, yeah. But you know what I mean? Like, it gave hey, us, uh, no, it gave us a childhood. childhood. It gave us a childhood. Absolutely. But based off of this right here... I will have to go. This the Dan Schneider bird. <laughs> BB Aldrin. I I hated it. Came out of my mouth. The... That's what she said. Oh, God. I would have to go Cartoon Network before we before we get too deep into things. Yeah, honestly, Cartoon Network is is goaded. The, but yeah, just... if you went network versus network, like all shows included. But granted, granted though, Cartoon Network did have Toonami. Cartoon Network did have Toonami. Toonami had the animes. Oh yes. And I'll never forget. Oh, yes. I'll never forget. And Adult Swim. And Adult Swim. Now I never I I never got to watch Adult Swim very often. None of us did. Well, at least us. Did. Well, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I remember freaking every time I go I'd go to school the next day. Be like, oh, you saw you, the guy last you, night. Yeah, you watch you watch Futurama. Yeah, no, <laughs> we prayed and went to bed by nine thirty. Futurama. <laughs> I don't think it was on Adult Swim. Uh, Team America was on Adult Swim. Robot Chicken was the biggest thing. Yeah, Robot. I remember Chicken I could never stay up to watch Robot Hunger Chicken. Force. Oh, Jesus Christ! I never got into Aqua Teen Hunger Force. I never did either. But Meatball I mean, was just it was crazy. Yeah, it was. But regardless, I would have to go with Cartoon Network. Yeah, I think it's unanimous on this. It's it's Cartoon Network. Cartoon if Network. we're if we're going cartoons versus cartoons, I, okay. Let's say if this is a battle, if it's an actual like fist on fight, right? Oh, okay. Uh, people on on the Nickelodeon side that have a chance of winning, <coughs> Ang. Obviously, the last Airbender, of course, Danny Phantom, Sokka, bending, bending, <laughs> bending all bending. elements, and your back, <laughs> and back, <laughs> and your mama's back for the uh, Water Tribe, <laughs> Jimmy Neutron, got a blast, and uh, Timmy from Fair Out Parents. I think they have the biggest because magic, wish for anything, yeah, and the brains, right? I mean, obviously, Danny Phantom and Ang are both like actual fighters. But if we were to look over to the to the uh, Cartoon Network side, it's fighter, 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 fighter. G- like Dexter. Dexter had hands. Okay? You've seen a lot of episodes where, where he invents something to put hands on people. When Dexter had his version of the Avengers. His ver- oh, yes! Oh, my God! Yes, I forgot! Oh, my goodness! Oh my goodness, I forgot about that. Sir, put that away. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, I forgot. Yeah. Hands down, if it was an actual brawl. <laughs> I, read one, I read one of the comments on this. Timmy just going to wish Ben 10 away. <laughs> 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 yeah, if it was an actual fist fight, you know, Nickelodeon does have the better advantage. Just based off of that, this on, on the picture, you know? Wait, you said Nickelodeon? Or yeah, Nickelodeon. Has the better advantage? Yeah, like you mentioned. Avatar? Danny Phantom? No, no way, bro. Samurai Jack, the Teen Titans. Someone has to take out Timmy. <laughs> someone, someone has to take out Ben someone, 10. Someone has to kill out. Someone has to kill. Someone has to kill Timmy. <laughs> <laughs> the fairly, they're fairly odd parents. They got to they gotta be dead. <laughs> <laughs> All fairies cannot, cannot exist. <laughs> Timmy Turner! <laughs> It's me joking about strangle. <laughs> the crimson chin. Bro. Oh God, not the crimson chin. Yeah, you. Yeah, it's that's tough. But okay, based off of this, before we go into this whole tangent, yeah, I would have to go Cartoon Network. I'm picking Cartoon Network. Yeah, I think Cartoon Network definitely has the dub. But Rotten brings up a good argument that there are some Nickelodeon carriers. Oh, for sure. There's like Ava- DPS. I would there. say Avatar. Oh yeah, especially if it's adult thing. Avatar and SpongeBob. Ca- SpongeBob carried Nickelodeon. I, I... Facts. You facts. 
look into your circle right now, depending on how old you are, and you mention a SpongeBob reference. If they do not understand your SpongeBob reference, you kind of know where they're at on on the on the friend list. On that too, I, I know I'm I'm close with some people that don't know it a lot. I still judge them from afar. Oh no. I- <laughs> They're still in the circle. I just, you know, I'm just... Eh. I'm judging you. Hard. Just from afar. No, I'm bringing it out. I'm bringing it from... Excuse me? You didn't watch SpongeBob? No. But I would say, yeah, I would I would say Cartoon Network, hands down. Cartoon Network. Yeah. That's absolutely crazy. But you guys let us know in the comments below who are you siding with. Who do you Who do you think would win the battle? Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon, let us know in the comments below who you choosing and who who would you choose as the main fighter? I want to know. Let us know in the comments below. This episode's gone on a little bit too long. So, Ratu, do the outro! <laughs> Did you guys have fun today? <laughs> what was your favorite part? Mine too. <laughs> Shout out to Vine. <laughs> I was like, and what was your favorite part? <laughs> it's when Boots took you to the back of the woods and clapped your cheeks. Mine too. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you for watching another episode of the Bailey Brothers Podcast. Make sure you subscribe. Continue to watch. If you, if this is the first episode you're watching. Watch the, the past like nine episodes. We've had quite a few already. We love you guys so damn much. Subscribe for more content. Give us a thumbs up. And let us know what you think in the comments below. Ask any questions that you want us to answer on the podcast. And we will see you guys later. Peace, y'all.